What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Honeybee. Back to deliver another daily buzz for you guys. Welcome to my new subscribers, my A1s, Day 1s. Those of you who have been rocking with your girl from the start. I appreciate you guys also very much. If you just so happen to stumble across this channel or video, you find something that you like right here, join us. Hit the subscription button down below, you guys. Leave comments. Uh, even if it's just an emoji of some sort, everything helps grow our channel. Um... Let's see what's coming towards you this Pisces season, y'all. So, ha <laughs> A lot of you got some passion, some sudden events, dramatic changes, instant attraction. Some of you going to be meeting someone. Or if you're already engaging with someone, it's going to be a lot of um, courageousness taking place. I'm hearing um, Phoenix rising. Oh, we. Yeah. Some of you have some serious love coming in. Super moon. It says emotions running high, cutting cards. Yeah. Oh, some things are going to be being revealed. Um, what's hidden? Scorpio transformation. So, yeah, for a lot of you, your love life is transforming. Your love life is transforming. Your life, as you know, it is transforming. Um, they want you to use your primal instincts. Uh, there's a lot of passion. You, there's also going to be a lot of people. Um, be, be, be weary of the trickery. The trickery. There's going to be, you know, some people may come towards you. Um, but it's almost like in, a, in an attempt to sell you dreams, like you're going to have some genuine people on your path, but you're also going to have some people that are, um, trying to deter you from your path, from your North node. There's going to be one person in particular though, that's going to be wish fulfillment. Someone that is supposed to journey with you, um, at this point in your journey, but you're going to have some people who are going to want to lay you down. Like, y'all know what I mean when I say lay you down, but they're not going to want to hold you up. You know, you're going to have a lot of people that's going to be lust lusting after you. They're going to come in um, very secretive, wearing a mask, like putting their best, best foot forward. So you're going to have some people that are, when you meet these people, you're actually meeting their representative. They're not going to show you their um, truest form. Damn, there's a movie, there's a show on AMC Plus. It's called Anne Rice's Mayfair Witches. Um, Lasher, Lasher was the demon that attached himself to the family, right? But when he revealed himself to, I think her name was Deirdre, he showed very many faces, right? So it's going to be people that are going to come in wearing masks, right? And I'm hearing dead inside, like these people, they did, oh damn, all right. Mm -mm. Y'all. You're gonna be you, some of you. Some of you may be dealing with a trickster. I'm telling y'all, some of you may be dealing with a trickster. One of these people in particular may be a trickster. This may be a friend, an enemy disguised as a friend. So a friend of me. This could be potential love partners. This could be people on on your job. But it, it's almost like to get. <clears throat> <coughs> oh damn! <laughs> they don't want me to say this. It's almost like to trick you off your path. Is what I'm hearing. Someone may try to maybe try to trick you off your path. Or like throw you off your game. Someone trying to throw you off your game. Someone trying to throw you off your game. So this may be someone from the past that's coming back. Surfacing up old issues. Oh damn. Alright. Someone trying to cut someone is coming back trying to throw you off your path collective. This is a warning message. Warning. Warning. They're showing me the caution sign the caution sign. Material possessions work. Income, values, aesthetics, luxury, security, attitude towards possession. So, someone may be trying to come back towards you because you're looking good at this time. Damn. You're in your north node and you're shining. Like, I'm hearing Gucci and gold. Like, you're looking good. You could be in a spotlight. Like, they could like your vibe, like your aesthetic. But it's like these people are wanting, or this person is, you know, they may come back on the, the, the skies that they have grown spiritually. Or, you know, like, they're more on a level of... You know, doing what you do. Like, they've tapped into... I'm here and tapped into their own gifts. Or, look what I could do. Or, I've been working on myself. And, you know, but it, it, they wearing a mask. This person is still... And I heard still. Still a snake. This person is still a snake. Somebody... Sh look. Pluto. Transformation, renewal, destruction, rebirth, death cycles, black magic, struggle, power, taboos, obsession. This person is obsessed with material possessions. You on the side of them makes this person look good. I, I'm just telling you that now. This person is still a snake. So this could be an old partner. This could be old friends. Oh, it's, de it's deceptive. Also with fire here. And then you have black magic. I'm telling someone is working. I don't want to say that. Spell work. 
it's almost it, it could be spell work so i'm not i don't know if they're actually going to pay a practitioner or this person is just trying to manipulate your mind right this person is trying to play mind games which is also black magic like anything that you try to like trickery of trickery right you could tell someone um like this would be the best opportunity of your life you know and then when they get there like they stepping in uh y'all know when you know you see an advertisement and you know the advertisement really draws you in and you order this certain type of this certain product and when you get the product it is nothing like the ad says like you know what i'm saying it's that type of energy somebody's gonna come and try to sell you some wolf tickets collective they're gonna come and try to sell you some wolf tickets most definitely A new start phases. Look ahead. Pay attention to new people, opportunities, and experiences that the universe puts in your path. Again, they want to throw you off your path. You have North Node and New Moon. There's a new moon coming up actually tomorrow. There's a new moon tomorrow. Like I feel like this is this is a test. This is a test. Someone is blinded by material possessions. They feel like whatever you're doing, whatever you have going on, you are the person that to, that can get them to success. You can get them. You can put them in a spotlight. Whoever this person is, they're obsessed with. The spotlight. They're obsessed with material positions. But you see, your statue, when it comes to that, is about to change as well. So because you're because you're in your north node, things are going to rev up for you. Once you cut energetic cords to certain people, places, or things, so you have people around you that are obsessed with your energy, and it's because you're mysterious. And you're intense, like people can't figure out. But you have some people, or one person in particular, that's wanting to get close to you. I'm hearing um the song by is it Dej Love where she says, I'm trying to get close to you. Yeah, someone's trying to get close to you. It's like they want you to take the they want to ride your coattail. But it's it's to take you off your path. This is like spiritual warfare. Or right, is this person is only gonna slow you down. I'm telling you this right now. Only gonna slow you down. It says it, pay attention. To new people, opportunities, and experiences that the universe puts in your path. A new start, new phases, look ahead. Like, so some from one from the past is coming back, but the universe is wanting you to forge your path forward. Keep looking ahead. Keep blazing the trail is what I heard. So you, this is trailblazer energy. You may be um, Aquarius, or you may have Aquarius in your second house, or your North Node. Aquarius is somewhere significant in your chart. And y'all know what I say all the time. Um, don't hold too close to the signs. But in this, I'm hearing Aquarius specifically. Pisces could be significant because there's a new moon coming up tomorrow, actually, and we are in Pisces season. So they want you to follow your North Node. For a lot of you, you are in your North Node at this time. And someone's trying to throw you off your path. Your North Node is your literally your purpose. But the universe is putting new people on your path. They want you to continue forging a path forward. Leave the, leave the, the leave, let the dust settle. Mm-mm. You got someone coming back to you. Um They trying to they trying to throw you off the game collective. What does this person want for my collective? Look, new and exciting opportunities. Focus on the new transcendence, maturity, fullness, fertility, first steps onto the new path. This person wants to go with you where you're going. Then someone wants to ride your coattail. Look, joining forces. <laughs> Empowering, activates, intensifies, focus, concentration, strengthen, strengthens, prominence, authority, uh, authorizes. Yeah, this someone may want you to vouch for them. Someone want to do what you do. They want to go with you. They want to go with you. But they want to go with you for selfish gain. They want to go with you for gain, for profit. They don't. They're not trying to go genuinely, genuinely because this is what they love. Or they want to go. They think it's cool. I heard an aesthetic. So whatever you are, however you are, like people, you have may have some people that's trying to join forces with you because they feel like it's look it looks good, right? So if you're spiritual, they want to be spiritual. I'm hearing ways bees or um the evil eye, like they want to know what those things mean, but they are using it for an aesthetic, not because that's what they're genuinely into. I, I hear it because it's the hype, like it's all the rave nowadays, you know, is what I'm hearing. So this is some you have some bandwagon type people on your trail. Most definitely. What what does this person want from the collective? 
They want to go with you. They want to go with you. They want to reap the benefits of you. You have new moon, north node, pink moon. That's about new. That pink, y'all know I talk about the pink diamond all the time. That's rare opportunity. They see you as fertile. They see you as in your energy. Um, I feel I feel like Empress energy, Emperor energy, Empress energy. She births, right? Very creative. You can birth. Like you have for some of you, your material harvest is picking up. It's also a prominent time right now, y'all, because there are going to be no planets in retrograde for a minute. So the universe is conspiring to bring all good things, all good things into your area. Uh, your area. I heard your area of. Well, I was going to say area of life, but then I heard area of expertise. All right. So you may have run across some people. Listen, someone don't want to do the work. Again, Roger Coattail. Someone do someone wants to attach themselves to you. Uh, and they want to be privileged. Like someone wants to someone wants you to take care of them with your occupation and high honor. Like, yeah, you like area of expertise, whatever it is that you do, someone wants to attach themselves to you because it'll make their name look good. And look for unexpected income. This person wants money without having to do the work. I'm telling y'all. I'm telling y'all, I'm telling y'all, for some of you, this could be an old lover, somebody that you put an end to, right? And this person see you as sudden wealth, and this person is impoverished right now. They want to, this person looking for a handout. Ugh, y'all, this is ridiculous. Mm. But change came out and it's in reverse. So this person has not done any change. And that's why I'm like, they're going to come in wearing a mask. This person is going to come in pretending that they have changed, but they have not changed. Look, family, distant horizon and family room in reverse. So if this person had another connection that they went towards, like this person, they have not. Ugh. This is crazy. There could definitely still be a third party. They're going to try to hide it, though. This person is going to try to hide it. That's not like a representative. They'll be making it seem like, oh, they left so-and-so behind and this and that. But this person, listen, they still dealing with so-and-so. Promise y'all. Let me get some characteristics. Haven't used this in a while. So for some of you, like I'm saying, you could have, you could be in a leadership position. I heard area of expertise. Look, team lead, manager, supervisor, supervisor, leader, energy, leadership, energy. Um, Give me some characteristics. Cause this is foolishness. <laughs> I'm telling y'all, this is definitely a warning message. Y'all don't let nobody come in and talking y'all out of y'all drawers now. Six 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 is here. Move forward. This I'm sure seeing six of swords. Move forward. Pharmacies. So this could be someone who was into a street lifestyle, street pharmacy. Libra may be significant. Definitely an imbalance. There's an imbalance here. There's an imbalance here. There's an imbalance here. Somebody, someone wants to ride your coattail, definitely. This could have been someone like, you know, like that you would get weed, like smoke weed with or do recreational drugs with or, you know, just look, religious path is here. And master manifesto. Like this person wants to, like, yeah, I'm telling y'all, whatever path you want, whether it be religious or spiritual, like I'm hearing, um, I heard master of your craft area of expertise so whatever it is that you do you're really good at it and this person wants to they want a piece of the pie this person also has a tendency to be sar sarcastic hot-headed but listen this person is a damn narcissist they could be of a darker complexion or darker than you and they could be a black man or a woman this person sees your success and this person is bothered almost envious if you will um two-faced it look that's what i'm telling y'all this person is going to come in wearing a mask the gemini energy could be a gemini or they could come in like i'm saying wearing a mask you're going to see this person's um true colors and then envious is here y'all remember look earlier when i said aquarius aquarius so some of you may be aquariuses or you could have this in your chart this person is very envious of you. This is air sign energy. So it could be we had Gem Gemini, Libra, Aquarius come out. So for some of you, this is definitely air sign. And look, installation as expert. Then I see whoever you are, area of expertise, master of your craft. And listen, everything that involves you is guess what? Protected. You have protected. They come out and look what's right under that. 777. Don't, don't play with them. Don't play. You cannot be played with. You cannot be played with. This is not going to affect you at all. Like the universe, your spirit team, they moving this person right on out. It's almost like they can't even get to you. See what I'm saying? Because protected, it, everything uh, that's, that, that's bad falls is beneath you. It's under you. It's like they can't they can't climb up to your level. So it's because they can't get to you, it's almost like 
Ooh, and I heard, okay, this is going to be deep. The devil is tricky. Because this person can't get to you, the only way that they can get to you is if you allow them in. So if you open yourself up to this person, if you take their phone calls, if you, I hear unblock them. So this may be someone you have blocked. This person is wanting you to, that this, this devil energy is trying to like attach. Like I said earlier about Lasher, he attaches himself to someone. Like this person, this energy is trying to latch themselves onto you. They're trying to latch themselves onto you. It's like they can't get to you because you're so protected. You're so protected, right? You're so protected. That is almost like you have to allow this person in. You have to give them access to you. Don't do it. Do not do it. This is this is this is crazy. Let, I want to see what they want. What does this person want? Look, they, for some of you, they want money. Practical, motherly, grounded, down to earth, generous, caring, good businesses, responsible. They want to ride your coattail. And what are they gonna do? Re rest recuperate time out meditate overwhelm solitude contemplation healing and king of pentacles like this person wants to <laughs> this crazy this person wants to go where you go i'm hearing i'll go everywhere you go like this person is trying to attach themselves to you but it's for finances it's trickery while they do nothing four swords is about rest recuperation right also four of swords follows three of swords so this person may be coming out of a heartbreak or this could be someone that broke your heart or this person is heartbroken because they can't cultivate anything good in their life right this person wants to be taken care of this person wants to ride your coattail this could definitely be someone that refused your offer in the past and went towards a third party this person may like this person is coming in to be nothing but a burden they're going to be nothing but a burden on eight of wands, right? Because this is what you're trying to move forward and this and with the Empress energy. Fertility, abundance, fast movement. And this because this person can see that you're having motion. You got motion in your life. And this person don't have shit going on. They can't make nothing go on. So what they're trying to do is they're trying to attach themselves to you. To ride your coattail to go where you go. This is crazy. This is crazy. It's also a person that plays a lot of mind games. This person plays a lot of mind games. But this is, the thing about it is, it's bothering, what's bothering some to this person right now is that they can't get over you. Like I said, they can't reach you. So what works with this, this person's tactics in the past, they worked on you. Now they no longer work. That's why I'm like, at this point, this person has to, you have to allow this person in. I'm like, I, how you hating from outside of the club? You can't even get in. This person ain't got no ticket. Get their tactics no longer work on you. You see this person for who they are. You see them. This is what's calling to me is this, this eye that's poking out. You see this person. Huh. Huh. Wow. This person thinks you got something to give them. They want, they want you to give them something. This person wants something from you. Page of Swords, they could also be watching you, spying on you. This person is trying to figure out. This person is trying to figure out. But listen, you are so protected with this temperance energy. And look, you have a gang of protection. With Three of Pentacles and a temperance, you have, like, for some of you, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Angel Michael. I'm hearing the Archangels. You have a spirit team that's not playing about you, like, at all. Like, this person can't get through. They cannot get through. <laughs> Whatever. This person does watch you, though. And look, Page of Swords and Nine of Wands. They're they're in an ongoing battle. Like, yeah, this person wants your help. This person wants a handout. Seriously. Three of Swords is here. They're heartbroken. Heartbroken. Betrayal. Love triangles. But this this is what this person did, did to you in the past. And now you've healed from that. And now this person is heartbroken because they've realized now that you are on your fool journey. They also feel like a fool for not taking a leap of faith with you. Justice is here. So this could definitely be a Libra energy. This came out already um, in the cards, the description cards, and a magician. This person is out here seeing you single, sexy, and free. This is definitely someone that you left behind. You went on your own journey. You manifested your own life. This person is seeing that you're having things. You have justice, the fool, the magician. Things are happening in your life. You're getting your just due. Everything is balancing out for you. And this person is reaping karma. All because they walked away from you. They didn't take a leap of faith with you. For some of you, this person could have did spell work. They could have did spell work to keep you from moving forward. To keep you from leaving. To keep you blinded to what they had going on. And it probably worked for a little while. But listen, you came out of that energy. And that's why I'm saying protected. This person cannot reach you where you are. You've up, you have you since ascended way beyond this person. So the only way they can get up get to you is they have to climb to get to you. And you also have to allow access. This Your spirit team has blocked this person's this person from getting to you. Look. 
You're so high up with the hangman. You've transcended beyond this person. Mm, that's how it happened. Look. Ace, Ace of Pentacles. This person wants some money. This person wants some money. This person wants to sleep with you. King of Wands. This could be a philanderer. The philanderer could also be known as the player. Like this person wants to sleep with you. I feel like if they could get an, a solid opportunity to come in and have sex with you, they feel like this would change the dynamic of the relationship. Look, source energy, not a swords. Sudden action, impulsive, quick, aggressive, take charge. Fast thinking, risk taker, brave. This is a look, ace of wands, y'all, and king of wands. I can't make this shit up. This person is someone that they, they think with their with their private. They think with their private. Listen, this person thinks with their private area. Again, swords energy. This person wants to win at all costs. This is someone who's very bitter. This person don't like to show weaknesses. They also pretend like they're a high achiever. This person lies about a lot of their accolades. They are, for some of you, they're going to lie about the money that they have. They're going to lie about they lie about their stat their their status. This person lies a lot. This person is a liar. They'll say every anything that they need to say. And for a lot of you, this person don't even they just act. They don't think before they speak or before they do things. This is someone you cut off. This person could have cut you off and then you cut this person off. This person is a liar, y'all. Telling y'all. This person may put on a persona like they're a boss. Um, like they're so smart, but this person thinks they're, this person is very rigid. Like they think they're smarter than the average bear. I'm hearing they think they know everything, but they, in all actuality, they don't know shit. They, this is someone they never switch up their game. Like they use the same routine with you or with other people. But the difference between you and others is you figured it out. Like you took the blinders off as it pertains to this person. They real bitter too. They real bitter. This person wants something from you collective. This person wants something from you. After they stabbed you in the back, right? And you went off and you expanded your life. This person wants something from you. They want something from you. Again, a king of swords energy. And queen of wands because they see you as ambitious. Also, queen of wands is the, the queen in the deck. Like, this could be known as um, someone who's unattainable. This person can't reach you. Again, they cannot reach you. This person can't reach you. They can't reach you. And it's bothering them. But I'm hearing they chose, they chose, and you could have been real loving and compassionate to this person at one time. Um, also, you're a visionary, and this could be you, the, your queen of cups, like you're defending your territory, right? Because this person then betrayed you and stabbed you in the back on multiple times. For a lot of you, you couldn't see past go with this person. This person also had always had choices, different opportunities, like you, you indecision. They were indecisive. You never knew where you stood with this person. Like this person kept you kept you in a lot of regrets, grief, guilt, loss, despair. Like it was a lot of back and forth, up and down. Like it was a lot of mental energy. This person played a lot of mental games. Seriously. Seriously. Mm, I'm finna get out this energy. I hope this resonated for one of you, some of you, all of you. Until next time. Oh, let me get a spirit message while I have time. Let me get I don't wanna I don't wanna end that here. Let me get a spirit message. Give me a message. Give me a message. Give me a message. Final message, spirit. All right. Look, look, shield yourself. Protect yourself from harsh or fear-based energies by envisioning a cocoon of healing light surrounding you. Archangel Michael, Gabriel, Uriel, y'all, you guys work with the archangels. If you are unaware, they are protecting you at this time against this energy. This person is a damn devil. Shapeshifter, I heard, is what I heard. Shapeshifter. Damn, that just summed up the reading. I'm like, they can't get to you. You're so protected. And it's pissing this person off, I, I might add. So amp up your protection. Work with your archangels. Work with your your um your ancestor gods. <laughs> Until next time. Love and light.